Who's ready to dance? I'm ready to dance. And yes, yo, I'm Stephanie, fellow dancer, here to teach you Lilac by IU. So let's get started. So this tutorial, I'm going to be mainly following IU, but sometimes I will switch to kind of the backup dancers. That's just for fair warning before we start this tutorial. So to start off, we're actually going to be facing back. I'm going to have my right toe next to my left foot, arms just down the side, and from there you're going to wait maybe like a few counts, four maybe. And from there I'm just going to basically kind of switch and kind of really stick out that right hip. And with that I'm going to bring my arm kind of gently out and then behind me. So it's going to be something like that. So actually facing back, it's going to be like this. So I really want to be looking forward at this point. And this one can be kind of like real fast and then slow at the end. From there, you're going to place your left foot out to the right. Still my back should be facing towards front. So it's going to be something like this. And then from there, we're going to do one kind of hip circle here. So it's going to be something like that. So we're going to take a few steps. Make sure that you're kind of give yourself room forward because this next part we're going to be moving forward. But basically, I'm going to take a few walks till my feet are together. Right toe next to left foot. Hands can be kind of just down the side for now. And then from there, I'm going to basically bring my wrist in. Palm should be facing down. And then from there, I'm going to, it's going to be like a bounce out and come up slowly until both wrists again are above the head. They should be kind of touching and palm should be facing away. But instead of doing it like in front, it's going to actually be back. So it's going to be something like that. So it's like quicken back and then slowly up. And with that, you want to look to the left. So now I'll see you that part before we go on. So from facing back here, I'm going to wait maybe like a few counts. Then from there, switch. So now we're looking front, bring that right arm in front. From there, place that left foot to the right here. A little hip circle there. A few steps to face front, bring it all together and bring those hands up above the head. From there you can do a little kind of like a little like a gentle cross and bring your arms down. So again from here it's like one two to here. But by this point you want to make sure that you're looking front. From there I'm going to take one step forward with my right. Then I'm going to place my left toe out to left, really bend that right knee. I'm going to place my left hand kind of on my, as close to my knee as I can and slowly come up. So it's going to be like one, two to here. So I'm kind of just bringing it to the front of my leg and then bringing up. And with that, you want to really bring up that left shoulder. From there, we're going to place both feet together. Both heels should be on the ground. I'm going to bring my left hand out to the left just like this. Right hand's going to kind of come up to the eye. And with that, I'm going to bend my knees. I'm going to kind of look up. You can arch your back if you want to. I'm gonna look up and then slowly come down. So it's gonna be like one, two, three to here. So as you slowly lower your hand, you're going to straighten your knees. From here then, you're then gonna go one to the left. So right hand's gonna come point to the left eye. And then from there, switch to the right. So we're gonna bend to the left, straighten to the right. And I'm going to move my finger to my right eye. So it's going to be like one, two to here. From there, then I'm then going to sit back down, kind of onto my left hip, slightly bent knees. I'm going to start to bring my left hand under, like I'm holding like a plate. Right hand's going to be kind of doing this motion here. So we're just going to be circling it to the right twice. With that, we're going to hop right, left, right, left. And with that, you also want to kind of tilt your head to the left here. So one, two, one, two. Also with that, you're going to move your hips in a circle from right to left. So like this. And then from there, I'm going to reach my left hand out. I'm going to kind of slightly lean to the right so I can stick out that right hip. Look up to that right hand. Also right palm should be facing front. 
and then from there you're going to slowly bend those knees as you bring that right hand in and then from there I'm going to just kind of tap my chest with my hand a little gently and I'm going to pick up my left foot. So then from here I'm going to be taking two steps. It's going to be left, right, and with the hands when we come from the chest we're going to go right hip, we're going to go hip with the right, hip with the left, right hand to the shoulder, left hand to the shoulder. So it's going to be one and two and like that. So again from here one and two and to here. From there I'm going to place my left foot out to the left here, sit onto that right hip, and with that we're going to kind of gently bring our right arm forward, then we're going to hop left right till our right foot's in front, and I'm going to basically kind of cycle my arms like this. Both my palms should be actually facing up, so it's going to be right, bring it in left, bring it in. With that, you're going to tilt your head back, and then bring the front. From now, we're then going to bend down onto our knees again, right hand, left hand to here. So the pattern is really bend, hop, bend, hop, bend, hop. So you're gonna do that three times. The arms are always gonna be the same for each cycle. So it's gonna be one, two, two, three, and from there, I'm going to be turning to the left until I'm facing to the right. I'm going to bring my left hand so it's on the outside of my left leg here. Right hand's going to come to the left shoulder. And then from there, you're going to uh, bend your knees and you're going to slide your hand down to the left. So it's going to be down to here. So if I'm here, again, we're going to turn and then you're going to come down. With that, you can also have, tilt your head slightly back into the left here. From there, I'm going to place my right toe out to the right, and then we're going to hop left right. So it's going to be like tap, hop, left, right, like that. With that, you're going to shake your shoulders right, left, right. So it's going to be one and two. And with that, just slightly bring your arms out. So one and two to here. From there, I'm then going to sit onto my left hip. I'm going to do like two revolutions of arms here and then from there I'm going to turn to the left so I'm facing that front left corner string my legs and I'm going to bring my arms in just like this palms should be facing forward and with that you can pop your chest out a little bit so again from here one and two one two pop and then from there you're going to take four steps so you're going to have one two three and then four, hop. With that, you want to be facing to the right, feet together, and arms down to side. So with the hands, it's just going to be two steps. It's going to slide your hands from the thighs up to the stomach. And then from there, you're going to push out and then bring it together. So again, it's going to be like one, two, one, two to here. So now let's do that part before we go on. So after our pose here, a little cross in front if you want to. Step one, two, slide up, bring it together and bend those knees. Slowly slide the hand down to the left and right. Transition back to left, hop one, two, one, two, lean to the right, slowly bend and bring that arm in and tap. One and two and one to here, two to here, three to here. Turn the face to the right and come down. Hop one and two, circle one, two, pop, chest to the left, and one, two, three, four, hop, facing to the right. From here then, I'm then going to place my left foot behind myself, and with that I'm gonna do kind of like a small, body way forward and then arch really slowly back. So it's going to be like one, two. So for two counts, with that you're just going to circle your fingers around each other like that. So it's going to be like one, two. Then from there I'm going to sit onto my left hip. I'm going to bring my hands back, 
palm should be facing to the ground. And also you want to slightly tilt your head back and to the left. Then from there, you're going to straighten your legs. You're going to bring your arms forward in front of yourselves. Palms should be facing away from you to the right here. And you're going to tilt your head to the right. From there then, you're then going to sit back onto that left. You're going to bring your arms, bend your arms in. Again, palms should still be facing away from you. Again, tilt that head back. And then from there, push back forward. And then from there, we're going to bring one, two. So, again, from here, bring it up and together. So, from the bend, it's going to be straighten those legs. And then bring that left foot, left toe next to right foot. With the hands, it's going to be bring it up. So, my palms are facing to left. And then bring it down so that's in front of you like this. So it's going to be up and then down. So again, from here, up, down. From there, you're going to hear pay and then G. On the G part, you're going to turn to the left and switch your toes. So right now, right toe should be next to the left foot. And with that, you're just going to do a little circle with the hands from the right to the left. So it's going to be G to here. Then from there, you're going to gently Turn your palm and place it onto your left palm. So this is the right to here. And then from there, you're going to switch your feet and you're going to slowly intertwine your hands together, just like this. So it's going to be slow. Again to here, one, two. With that, you really want to get that arch and you really want to tilt that head slightly back. So again, from here to here. And then from there, we're going to take one, two, three, four. So three steps, starting with the right, and then hopping, our feet together, arms just down the side. With the hands, it's going to be right, left, right, and then down the side. From here, then, I'm going to step to the, right, to the left. I'm going to bend my left knee. I'm going to bring my right hand cross over to my left leg. And with that, I am flexing my wrist, and my hand is as, as a fist. From there, you're then going to pick up your right foot, and you're going to kind of turn to face more front. So if I'm kind of facing left here, it's going to be more front here. And with that, you're just going to circle your arm, right arm, up and to the right and down. So it's going to be one, two. Then from there, we're going to do the same thing, but now to the right. One, two. And I'm going to step left, right toe, again, kind of facing more to the left here. And with that, arms are just going to go, if I'm here, it's going to go cross down, up, and out. Just like I'm carrying trays on both hands here. Or you can think of the palms facing up. And then from there, I'm going to turn to face the right. And with that, again, we're going to intertwine our fingers together to here. And then from there, I'm going to step onto my right foot. Oh, my, sorry. I'm going to step onto my left foot. Really stick out that left hip and turn to the left until I'm facing front. And with that, you want to end kind of slightly bent knees, kind of your weight really supported onto that right hip and leg. So with that, it's like that. And with this, just kind of go with the flow. Just go in the direction of where you're turning. And the left arm is just going to be doing the work. Right arm is just going to be doing whatever. So again, from here, it's going to be one, two, to here. And then a little thing before we go to the chorus, we're going to go right, left, and then from there, come up. So it's going to be right step, stick out that right hip, left step, stick out that right hip, really bend those knees. And then from there, I'm going to just kind of come together, either with your heels down or just right toe next to left foot. If you have trouble bringing both feet down, but basically you want to do kind of a slight body wave here. So it's going to be something like that. And with that, with the hands, we're going to go out to the right, out to the left. Both palms should be facing away from you. And then from there, across to the thighs, 
and slide up to kind of like the chest here. So again, this can be right, left, come up. So now let's review that part before we go on. So from facing right here, I'm going to place that left foot behind. We're going to go one, two, slowly leaning back, sit back onto the left, come forward to the right, push in and back to left, push out to the right, come up, and down, and bring it again. From there, turn the left to face left, bring that right palm to the left palm, switch legs, and close those fingers together, and then from there, right, left, right, hop. To the left, and swing, to the right, and swing, step left, right to here, turn the face right, uh, fingers entwined together, step, and turn to here, step right, left, and slide up. So then from here, I'm going to very, very quickly place my right heel down, if you're doing that, but if you're here, that's fine too. But from here, I'm then going to hop, basically pick up my left and hop till my feet are hip distance. And I really want to be on that left hip. So again, from here, it's going to be one, two. And with that, the arms are just going to come up and out slowly. And with that, you want to make sure that your left hand is slightly higher than the right. By the end, your right hand should be kind of slight, very slightly or at shoulder level. Left hand's going to come up about head level here. With that, you want to make sure your arms are really nicely rounded and your palms are facing towards you. And with that, you want to look up to your left hand. So then from here, we're going to basically be moving our hips. We're going to go right, left, right to here. So these legs should be straight and you're just moving these hips. With the hand, it's going to be right, left, right to the hip. So left hand's always going to be doing the work, or left hand's going to be doing the work, right hand's going to be doing nothing. So it's going to be again, right, left, and then to the right hip. So then, all together is going to be one and two, and with that you can add a little head movement to here, but by this point you want to make sure that your head is tilted to the right. From there then we're going to go one and two to here. So it's going to be one, two. So always starting left, or, or always starting left, right, to here. And we're going to do that twice. And with that, on the second one, you want to bend your left knee and really stick out that left hip. So with that one, two to here, arms are going to stay the same. And then from there, I'm going to sweep my right arm down and then bring it up till it's like in front of my shoulder. Palms facing away from you. With that, you're going to slide your right foot in and hop. So by this point, you should be facing kind of to the left. From here, we're gonna be doing kind of a fun little footwork here. Basically, we're gonna be hop sliding, hop sliding, hop sliding, back towards the right. We're always gonna start with the right. So we're gonna hop, kind of slide, and I'm doing a slight rond de jambe back. Not very far, it's like that much rond de jambe. But it's going to be one, two, three, like that. So it's always going to be right foot, hop left, hop right, and then we're going to bring it together and turn to face kind of the front right corner or to the right here. So then with the arms, Basic, it's pretty easy. It's just basically going left, right, left, and then bring it to neutral again. So now all together we're going to go one, two, three, four, to here. And then from there I'm going to step back left, right, left, right. So it's always going to be, well, always going to be stepping back, left, right, left, right, bringing that right toe next to the left foot, kind of facing front left corner here. With the hand, it's going to be circle that hand up, 
and snap kind of, and then bring it down. So it's gonna be one, two, and then one, again, bring it up, and now we're just gonna wiggle our fingers and bring it together and that arm down. So with that, you're just wiggling your finger, fingers and your palm should be facing front here. From here, I'm gonna step to the right. And with that, I'm going to basically circle my right arm around to the right and behind my head, like that. So it's gonna be one, two. And with that, you wanna bend your knees once your hand is behind your head. And then from there, you're going to hop together, facing front, two, three. So if I'm here, the arm's gonna go one, two. So two revolutions like this to here. Again, out in, out in to the left shoulder. So again, one, two, one and two. With that, you're going to basically sit onto that left hip and you wanna look to the left. From here then, you're then going to step right, left. Again, palm, both palms should be facing away from you. And then from there, you're going to kind of step onto the right foot and then bring those hands together like this. So one, two. So then from here, we're gonna step right and then left. Again, bent knees and palms should be facing away from you. And from there, I'm going to kind of slightly pick up my right foot, straighten my leg, and then I'm going to bring my hands up. By this point, we're going to then slowly bring our hands together into like a picture frame. So left hand's going to be on the bottom and facing back. Right palm's going to be on top and facing front. So with that, it's going to look like this. And with that, you can also look to left. So again, it's going to be right, left, or right, left, and then bring it together. From there then, you're then gonna close that right hand, you're then gonna flip that left hand, and you're gonna transition, and then from there, step left, open up. So again, from here, it's like one, two, step, one step with the right, and then one more swing to left here. And with that, you can really look to left. So then after that, stepping to left, you can just hop your feet together, doesn't really matter. Hop right to left, or hop left to right, doesn't really matter. Just your feet together, and arms can be by the side. Or if you want to, you can keep your left hand in front of your hip. From here, we're gonna go right, left, right, hop to here. So, really small, just in place. Feet hip distance, very just kind of loose, gentle. And with the hand, again, left hand can just be in front or it can be to your side. And with that, you're going to basically kind of twirl or fake twirl your hand in front of your face. So it's going to be one, two, three. And with that, you want to make sure it's on the right side of your face. From there, I'm going to place my left toe cross over my right. I'm going to point my right finger up to the diagonal. Left hand can just come to side. Then from there, I'm going to place my left toe to the left. I'm going to point front with my left hand. Then I'm going to hop left, right, bring that toe out. Again, point up, hop right, left, pointing front, and then hop again, left, right, pointing up. So again, from here, one, two, three, point up, front, up, front. And then from there, one more, up, again. From there, we're going to go right, left. So it's always going to step right, left. And with the hand, it's always right, left. Pop, both palms should be facing down. So it's going to be one, two. And then from there, I'm going to just kind of pick up my foot, place my right toe down. And I'm just going to rub my, left, my right thumb from the right to the left over my lips. So it's going to be right, left, one, two. And then from there, step right, slow, left, slow, and hop. With the hand, it's always going to be to the right and to the left. And with that, my palm should be facing towards the front. So one and two. And then from hop. 
and then we're gonna do it again. So one, two, three, cross, left, right, left, right to here, again, right, left, to the lip, and then from there we're gonna go one, two, so we're gonna go again left, or we're gonna go right, left. Then from here I'm gonna do really quick, so it's gonna be like one, two, circle that arm up, kind of horizontal, to here. So again, it's gonna be slow to the right, slow to the left, right, left, really quick, or right, left, really quick, switching those feet, and then circling that arm in, and up until it's horizontal to the floor. Palm should be facing towards the front, and you're gonna be looking to the left here. So now as we do that part, before we go on, so from our one, two, three, we're gonna hop to the left, one and two to the hip, one, two rocks to the left, slide it in and hop. Right, left, right, left, bring it together. One, two, one, two to here. From there, step to the right, hop together to the left shoulder, right, left, and bring it up and down. From there, close the hands and step forward on the left, step right, and then big swing to the left here, and then hop together. From there, hop right, left, right, cross that left foot, left, right, left, right to here. Step right, left to the mouth, step right, and then left slowly and hop. Same thing, right, left, right, cross, left, right, left, right, from there, step right, left to the lip, slow to the left and right, quick right, left, bring the hand up and then look to the left. So then from here, you're going to kind of jerk that hand a little bit to the right and then slowly bring it down. So it's gonna be like one, two, three. And with that, you're gonna to start to turn your head to the front. From there, I'm just gonna place my right foot, my right heel down, and we're gonna go one, two. So it's gonna be one flick, kind of shoulder height, and then two, really bend those knees and flick that hand up high. So it's gonna be like one, two, to here. Then from there, I'm gonna pick up my right foot and we're gonna go one, two. So with that, from here, pick up that right foot, place that right foot down, stand up, we're gonna circle our arms down into the right, or down into the left, up, and then come to here. So by this point, I wanna make sure my right shoulder is forward, right arm can be forward as well. Left arm's gonna be to the side. So again, from here, one, two, one, two to here. And then from there, you're gonna to switch to left. Also notice that I am sticking my hips out for this part. Then from there, I'm gonna go one, two. So with this, you can do like whatever hand, whatever side you want to. So it can be like that, it can be like that, whichever one, it doesn't really matter. But one, two, to here. But you just want two taps. And then from there, I'm gonna step left and then right. I'm gonna bring my palms together, prayer. So left palm should be facing up. Then we're gonna go little flick out to the right. Again, one more palm together. And then flick out up high above the head and pick up that left foot or the right. Yeah, the left foot, pick up that left foot. So it's gonna be one, two, one, two to here. And then from there, a few steps until you're facing to the front left corner and you want your hands behind your back like this. So straight arms, hands just kind of behind the butt. From here, we're gonna step one, two, kick, one, two, place. So it's gonna be right, left, kind of kick and straighten that left leg. So we're kicking that right leg, one, two, place. 
So with this, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And with that, you can add a little releve if you want to. That's just optional. With the positioning, you want to go first to the right, then you're going to swing to the left and place. Again to the right and to the left. With the hands here, we're going to go one, two, bring it out and to the right. So right arm is always going to be doing a work here, but you're going to bring it out as you swing your right leg around. And then one, two, three. So on the walks to the left, you're just going to kind of pound your chest with your right fist here. So again, one, two, three, one, two, three. Same thing, one more time. One, two, three, one, two, three. So on that second one, you do want to bring it back behind and swing it around to here. From here, I'm going to step to the right, sit down onto my right hip here. I'm going to cross my hands and then slowly bring them out to my cheeks. Palms should be facing away from you. So it's going to be like this to here. And with that, you can tilt your head to the right here. Then we're going to go one, two. So again, it's going to be a circle down the left. And then really stick that arm out. So you want to end with your right arm down to the right. Left hand is going to be to the chest. And you want to be kind of tilting your head to back and to the right here. Or you can keep it neutral. It doesn't really matter. So again, from here, it's like one, two, one, two. So with that, with the foot, when you circle, you're going to transition your right foot from back to front to here. And with that, you can just keep your heels on the ground or do a little roll of it. It doesn't really matter. So again, slowly back, circle to here. And then from there, a few steps to face right. Again, palm or hands to side. And with that, you can add, you can do whatever arm you want for that walk. So here, you can go one, two, three, four, like that. So now let's do that part before we go on. So from our position here, again, bring that right arm to the right, look front. One down low, one up high. Step and left, or sorry, right shoulder, left shoulder. One, two taps to here. Step left, right, or sorry, right, left low, right, right high, left foot up, and one, two, three, four, until we're facing to the kind of the front right corner. From there, one, two, swing, one, two, place. One, two, swing, one, two, place to here. From there, sit onto that right hip, circle those arms to here, and then one, two, three, four, hop to here. So now we're going to do kind of a variation of the um, first pre-course that we did before. But basically we're going to do the same thing, one, two, come back down, forwards, back, and then from there you're going to basically bring it all together. So we're going to step, skip this part. So we're going to go straight up like this, left toe next to right foot, hands in prayer position, like at base level here. Then from there, I'm going to step to the front with my left foot, really stick out that left hip. And I'm going to bring my hands so it's cradling the left side of my face. So it's going to be a one, all the palms facing away from you. Then from there, you're going to step and place your right foot in front. You're going to go one, two, and down. So it's going to be left, right, two, and then three slow. So this is bending and then straightening, two, and then slowly bend onto that right hip here. So again, one more time from here, we're going to go left. Then right, two, to here. And then from there we can go one, two, three, four, 
four counts or three steps, however you want. And so your feet are together, arms are down inside. Again, you can do whatever you want with those hands. Same thing here, left, right, bring it up to the right and step. And then from there, right, left, and slide it up. So now as you do that part, before we go on, very quickly. So from facing right here, we're gonna go one, two, come down, forwards, back, bring it all together, left, right, one, two to here. And then from there, a few steps to here. To the left, to the right, bring it up, to here, step left, right, left, and slide up. So, second chords is pretty much the same as the first one, so I'm not gonna go through that again. So now onto the bridge. So after our last, this part, one, two, here, you're welcome to do this part, and then also you're welcome to do kind of the major IU part, but I find it not very interesting. So I'm gonna go to actually the backup dancer. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this and then turn to face to the right front right corner here. From there you're going to I'm going to then turn to the left and I'm going to bring my right hand up and over until the back of my right hand is to my left cheek and I'm facing to the front left corner. So if I'm here, it's going to be 1 2 to here or circling actually to here. You're going to wait here a few counts. And then from there, I'm going to turn back to the right. I'm going to then circle my left hand up and over until it's crossed in front of my right arm and it's to the right side of my cheek. So again, from here, one, two, three. And then from there, you're going to open those hands up. And then from there, a little tap on the cheeks here. And with that, you can change your legs or change your feet, knees, here, like that. From there, I'm then going to step to the right. I'm going to do two arm revolutions around each other, bring that left toe next to my right, and come up. So it's going to be one, two, to here. So again, to here. Once I'm at this position, you're then going to come, you're then going to come up, bringing that right arm up, and over. And with that, it's kind of like you're kissing the inside of your uh, right wrist here. So it's going to look like something like that. From there, I'm then going to place my left foot behind. I'm going to push my hands down and slightly behind myself. Then I'm going to step one, two, three, reach out and bring it together. So again, one, one, two, out to the left. And with this, you can do really whatever arm you want, like that. But then you want to bring your feet together and arms together. From there, I'm then going to step out to the left, kind of slightly stick out my left hip, place my hands crossed in front. Both palms should be facing down, and my hands should be on the left side of my body. Then from there, I'm going to switch, so it's going to be kind of like a quick circle here, so one, two. And as I do that, I'm going to now really stick out my right hip, really lean to the left here, bring my hands to my cheek, so the back of my hands. So it's gonna be one, two, and then from there, I'm going to bring my hands crossed over to the right side here, kind of facing front right corner now. And palm should be again facing down, but now my hands are as fist. And then from there, you're going to bring it all together. And you're going to bring your arms up and down to your side, like here. And then you'll wait for the last course to happen. So what I just did there is a variation of many, many different parts. So you're welcome to look back at the original dance to see kind of like which parts you want to do, if you're interested. So now let's review that part before we go on. So after our last here to here. Again, turn to face left, way here if you can. From there, turn to face to the right, release those hands, and a little tap. 
Step one, two, to here, and come up. From there, step back, one, two, reach out to the left, bring it together. Step left, lean left, bring it to the right, and bring it together. So then from here, I'm gonna be kind of splitting it into a little bit of a use part, a little bit of backup dancer, so just as warning, but they're pretty, pretty similar. So then from here, what we're gonna do is we're gonna really bend and we're gonna kind of do a body wave, hip wave to the right. So it's gonna be like one, two, and then to the left as well. With the hands, we're gonna go one. So we're gonna push them out to the right, close them, and bring them in to the left. So with the feet, we're gonna go one, two, one, two. And with that, you really wanna bend. So one, and then two. From there, I'm gonna step right, pick up my left foot, step left, pick up my right foot, and then place it down. With the hands, it's always gonna go left, right, and then I'm just gonna wrap my left arm around my body. I'm gonna fully bring my right arm up, and I'm gonna bring it down and wiggle my fingers. So again, it's gonna be one, two, and slowly come down. So with that, you're just gonna slowly bend your knees as you wiggle your fingers down. From here, I'll show you the footwork first, but we're gonna go hop, one, two, hop, one, two. So it's gonna be a kick right, hop onto the right, kick left, hop onto the left. So this is gonna be kinda quick. So it's gonna be like one and then two. So for that first one to the right, we're just gonna bring our arms in front of ourselves. Palms facing front, really should be in front of your chest. So you're gonna go right and then left. You're gonna straighten them down about lower than 90 here. And then from there, we're gonna do a few steps until we're facing kind of the front leftish corner. So again, one, two, one, two, three. And then one, two, three kind of steps, slowly turning to face front, always right, left, right. And with that, you're just going to bring up the left shoulder, right shoulder, and then left shoulder. And then from there, you can switch sides or you can come here. But basically, you want to gently flick that hand forward like that. Little bend, and then come up. From there, again, step to the right. Right hand's going to come back. But then from there, you're going to just tap the back of your head like twice, three times. So it's one, two, one, two. Then you're going to come down slowly a little bit. Then I'm going to step right, left, and then right again. So these two steps is low, low, and then high. If you just notice, my right toe is just next to my left foot for that last one. So again, from our here, I'm gonna go cross one, two, slide it up. Then from there, come up. So really strain those legs, strain those arms. Palms should be facing to the front, and then slowly come down. So that part's really quick. So one, two, up and down. And then from there, you can slide forward with that left foot. Place that right foot forward. Step back onto the right and really swing to the left here and hop. From there, we're gonna do something different from the other courses. So just, just this morning. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna step right, left toe out. So with the arms, it's always gonna be right, left, and then out to the diagonal. So right's gonna be up high, left's gonna be low. So we're gonna go one, two. Then from there, I'm gonna hop left, right. I'm gonna point down with my right finger to the left. And then from there, hop right, left. Point that left finger to the left here at 90. So then from here, I'm gonna place my left toe in front of my right, turn and face right. I'm gonna point one, up high, bring it in, and two low. So it's gonna be like one, two, like that. From there, bring your feet together, bend those knees, 
come up to here. So hands are just going to be on hips normally, so one, two, down for the bottom, and then up to the hips. And with that, you're going to really bend down and come up. With that, you can just keep your hands on your hips, or you can bring just your right finger up to the diagonal here. From there, we're going to hop one, two. So we're going to hop back onto the left, and then onto the right. And with that, this is like really small jumps. Mainly kind of just like sliding backwards. And also with that, you want to open up your chest here to the front and then close it to the back. And then from there, you're gonna place your left foot next to your right. You're gonna circle your arms or your hands from the left to the right. With this, your palm's going to be facing you this whole time. So it's just going to be like that. Also, you can add a little hip circle left to the right. So one, two to here. And the, the parts are going to differ a little bit. So if you want to do IU's parts, it's going to be like something like this. She's going to just walk to her spot, probably center, with the little arm to the right and to the left. Or you can do a little bit of the backup dancers just to mix it up if you want to. So again, from here, we're going to go hop one, two, one, two. So it's just a chasse to the right, chasse to the left. Again, arms are going to go right and left. So one, two, one, two to here. So then from wherever you're coming from, we're going to place your right foot in front, really turn to face left, and we're going to basically be doing this move. So it's going to be right, stick out that right hip, left, stick out that left hip. So this is going to be the movement. Something like this. Really bend those knees. So you're going to be doing that for maybe like seven, six, six, seven counts. And with the hands, you're just going to bring them to like base level. Hot prayer position here. We're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six. Basically, you're just going to be rubbing them together like this. So all together, it's one, two, three, four, five, six steps, and then one and two. So with that, it's going to be like a sort of two, three. So it's like a one, two, three, coming down, bending those knees. So up and then down. From there, step front with that left foot, point down with the right. Straighten that left leg, pick up the right, point with your left hand. Again, hop right, left, and then come up high. So again, it's going to be left, pick up right, hop right, left, pick up right to here. With the hands, it's always going to be right, left, right, left, going from low to high. So one, two, three, four to here. And then from there, you can do a little, again, the chasses or this part again if you want to. With the chasses, you're welcome to bring them up to your mouth as well. So you can go like one, two, one, two here. From here, we're going to do the same thing as we did before. So one, two to the diagonal, down to left, to the right, and one, two hip hops. Come up to here. Left hop, left, right hop, circle around, and then from there, Again, you can change it up, do I use part or more, sh or actually I think it's like one, two, three, four, or something like that. Definitely do check down the description box below if you want to learn that part. But I'm going to do a little bit of I use part, and then from there we're going to do what we did in all the other courses. So on that last fourth one, you're going to go back to what you know from before, one, two to here. And then from there, I'm going to slowly go to the left, slide to the right, bring my feet together, so right toe next to left foot, turn to face left, and then from there, we're going to flick out and slowly bring that hand down. And with that, think of like you're imagining you're next to a tree and you're um, appreciating the tree. 
Also, you're welcome to do backup dancing because I believe they're going to be the tree. I don't know their positions exactly, but you can definitely look down in the description box below for more details on that. But otherwise, whichever pose you're in, this is going to be your ending pose. So now let's view that part before we end this tutorial. So I know it was a lot. We'll go slowly. So after our hop and bring it together, we're going to go down and up to the right. Down and up, bring it in. Step one, two, and come down slowly. Hop and kick to the right, hop and kick to the left. One, two, three steps, and one, two, three steps together. Roll foot forward to here. Step out to the right to here, or sorry, step out to the right. A few pats on the head, come down. Step right, left, bring it up and together. From there, you can slide forward and then swing to the left here and hop. Step right, left, down to the left, to the right, and one, two hip hops. Bring it down and up. One, two, circle. Little chasse, or whatever you think. One, two, three, four, five, six steps here. Seven, eight, come down. From here, right finger, left. Right finger, left. Little chasses, if you want to. Same thing, so one, two, to left, right. One, two, come down and up. One, two, Circle, change it up to I use part, and then we go here. So one, two, three, cross, left, right, left, right, right, left, to lip, slowly to the left, slot, or slowly to the right, sorry. Step to the right, little flick, and slowly bring that hand down to your final pose. Great job, guys. Give a hand to yourself because you learned this whole dance. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you learned all of this dance with me. That makes me really happy. And if you wish to review what you've learned in this part, then take a look down in the description box below. Anyways, I challenge you guys to be better me because I know you can. Also, please do subscribe for more cool dance tutorials like this. If you haven't, that would be awesome. And I'll see you guys in the next dance. Happy dancing!